once again now we are here and we are going to fight for our life brother and sisters as i just told you we are in a workshop a workshop whereby we are going to transform our life a workshop where we are we are we are materializing our our vision Yes, our vision, which yesterday was just a picture, we are now materializing it. It's becoming a, a tangible life. Yes, we have been dreaming of many good things. You have been dreaming of many awesome life uh, uh, things in your life. And it had been just, just unreachable dreams. But today, as we are in this type of prayer, aggressive prayer, yes, a, 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 a prayer with power, powerful prayer, we are going to change our lives. Whatever the enemy had stolen us, brother and sisters, we are going not to beg our enemy to release our blessing, not to beg our lives to open uh, our enemies, to open the, the jail where they had been and lock, locking us, but we are going to command we are going to command and it will come to pass in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Brother and sister, yes, today we are talking about forwardness and backwardness. People have been suffering of backwardness. They have been investing in education of the children, in their own education, in business, in anything. But something terrible happened. Instead of growing, Instead of being developed, brother and sister, we are forced to realize that we have been moving backwardness, backwardly. How? What has been happening? Something must be eating us. Brother and sister, what I'm here to tell you is that God in his love, God in his faithfulness, or the agenda of God is to see us growing, is to see us develop, is to see us not only alleviating poverty, but we are here to eradicate poverty. Brother and sisters, oh, in Ecclesiastes chapter 10, verse 7, the Bible says, I have seen slaves or oh, riding horses as if they were princes, and I have seen, unfortunately, princes walking on the earth as if they were slaves. This is the irony or the irony of life. This is what God is seeing when he, when, when, you know, his love that tells us to live a wonderful life. Brother and sister, in the book of uh, uh, Proverbs 139, verse 14, the Bible says, I praise you, God, I worship you. I love you because you, I, I, I was created in in fearfully and a wonderful way. <laughs> Hallelujah. Today, God said, my people have been stolen of their blessings and no one is there to, re to restore what they have been stolen of. No one is there to rescue them from the jail where they have been put in. No one is there to remove the lim limitations. You know the limitation. You, it's as if they have put a red, a red and told you, you will not reach here. You will not go beyond this. Or you, you have just to buy, to buy, a, to buy what? To buy a chair. You can't buy a car. You are there just to buy what a pen. You cannot buy buy a car. You can oil. Oh, you can you can do what you can have a small house, but you cannot have a, a what an apartment. But today we are here to force our way into our life. 
Yes, come out of the shadow of your of your life because what you are you are thinking that you are enjoying, what you are think that that is that is this is your life. No, my brother, my sister, you are the hair of the kingdom of God. If you are the hair of God, try to imagine, dare to imagine. Yes, you are not on a tycoon. No, you are the owner of everything here on the earth. <laughs> Hallelujah. This is the, 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 the plan of God for you. This is the will of God. Brother and sister, today now, Jesus, we remember Jesus who came and he said, now, Father has been wondering how these people will be restored to their former state, how they will be restored to the ownership of everything here on earth, how they will be restored to the status of being a heir of the kingdom of God and being a prince, a prince or a princess. Ah, today, ah, the spirit of the living God is upon me. He has anointed me. I have to bring good news to the whole world. My brother, my sister, me too as said the saint of Jesus Christ all here on the earth. Whoever is receiving this uh, voice, uh, the spirit of the living God is here upon me, upon all of us to do what Jesus provided us. And Jesus said, all is accomplished. Jesus has given us the provision to be restored to our former state, to own everything that the enemy had stolen from us, and to be able to enjoy our status, our ideal. Ah, yes, the star of our life that the enemy had blown out. Now, we, now, as I said earlier, it is not anyone else. It's up to you now. You are the one to build your, uh, your life. You are the one now to materialize your dreams. You know, the Bible says in the book of First Corinthians, chapter 4, verse 20, the Bible says that the kingdom of God is not of mere words, of mere, mere visions, of mere, mere pictures. No. But it's the kingdom of power, the power to materialize, the power to take those pictures and to make them in something tangible. Or oh, you have been dreaming of a huge amount of money. That, that is just, just what, it's a dream. But right now, you are the one to call upon that money. Yes, it will come and you will enjoy it. You will put it into your account. You will put it into your pocket. Yes, you will be able to give it to your wife. You will be able to give it to your children. You will be able to give it to any member of your families and friends because that money, that huge amount of money is not dreams, but it has been materialized. It's a dream that has been fulfilled. It's you now. We are going right now in the workshop. We are going right now in a workshop where we are going to take the picture. We are going to the, the pictures are already designed. Yes, but we are going now to build. We are going to, uh, to build on our foundation that we have already. And we are going to be full people. Otherwise, people are living the shadow of their lives. They are living just, 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 just pictures. We have a power in prayer. The prayer we are going to make, to, to say today, it's not any prayer, but it's the prayer that made Paul, uh, Peter come out of the jail where he was surrounded by 16 armed, armed soldiers. The prayer that killed the death that was trying to kill him. The prayer that forced the metallic double locked doors that had made him in jail. <laughs> Brother and sister, we are going to do something special. 
Let me tell you that now we no longer have any time to to waste. But as I am going to lead you in this prayer, let us start now. The problem, what what is the problem? It's sin. It's something that the enemy put in us and we accepted it. Or to, 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 to say it better, we ourselves sold ourselves to Satan. And Satan now, when we sold ourselves and when we became slaves of the king in the kingdom of Satan, now he they are his and his agents to do whatever they want against us. They have the full access on our money. They have the full access on our 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 our, our, our education. They have the full access on our business. On our our body, our health, in everything, because we made ourselves slaves to him. Now, with the first now, all the priority of the other priorities, it's just to release ourselves, to redeem ourselves. To come out of the state of, of, of slave. So long as you are a slave, brother and sister, you will not live any independent, any freedom. You will not live any independent life. You will not, in fact, enjoy life, but you will endure sufferings because someone else is making you live the way the way he wants when now he's your enemy he will inflict you uh, sufferings he will put in you bad things in fact they will be killing you in fact you will be moving backwardly not forward now in your life you know it you do not know it but in a, give, a, a given day or a given date, someone somewhere in your families, or not uh, only families, but around you, but someone who had, who could uh, uh, be with you, or who could know you, even who could not know you, may, might have been uh, the cause source of your problems let's give you an example you have you come from a family whereby they worship idols the factor of worship idols that is a cause of your sufferings not only financial problems but also healthy way why uh, uh, not only about the health, but also the education about about your marriage, about about your relationship with other people. Yes, the Bible tells me in the book of uh, of uh, uh, of uh, Judges chapter six, the Bible says that God uh, told Gideon, Gideon. Gideon, now I have chosen you to go and to deliver Israel, my people, because they had they did what is wrong in my eyes, in my sight. That's why I, the Median now were able, were allowed to come and to. Do anything they want against you. They killed Israel, the Jews. They they, they took they they what they, they they crops. They killed them. They took them to say to serve them. They they took their money, everything. But God told him, "You first of all, you destroy the altar of the the the, the gods of your father." <laughs> there we are now. So long as you are uh, uh, you, you 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 come from a family where there is uh, um, idolatry, that is the cause of your suffering. 
in all areas, be it financially, be it health, be it, be it education, be it uh, marriage, be it uh, everything. Now, today I'm telling you, go on and you too, go and destroy the altar of uh, the gods of your family on your mother's side and on your father's side. Because they are on the, that altar, when they go to worship there, they bring what they call prayers, but in fact it is not prayer, because all the prayers are, are said to God, who created heavens and earth and everything there is. But to the others, it's just a request, it's just a, no, it's not prayer. But it's an agreement that they sign, saying that you you worship uh, that idol and you uh, believing that that idol and its kingdom are going to bless you. Maybe you are looking for ch children because you are a barren. When you go there, they tell you go and do this this day. When you do it. You have now signed an agreement. Now you have sold yourself. And the devil, through them, they have given you a package which is full of suffering. No education, no children, no peace, no, no house, no, nothing. All the days of your life, you are bound to do the things that they asked you to do are the things they didn't tell you because they are wicked. Are the things they just be striking with you with the sickness and disease and you do not know where they are coming from. You start feeling things moving in your body. Oh, you, you start feeling uh, spiritual weak and uh, sexual weak or no money. Everything has gone. Your dreams now have become the dreams that you are not familiar with. You start hearing, hearing, hearing a voice that you, you, you do not know anything about. Today, my brother, my sister, the first thing we are going to do is just to ask for forgiveness from God that we are from the families that we that have been worshipping evil spirits. That they have signed agreements with the kingdom of Satan. They have, we have, they have sold themselves and their children, you inclusive, to the kingdom of Satan. You are no longer the one living, but it's them forcing you to live the life they want you to live. In fact, it's not you living, but it's the kingdom of Satan. By the way, you might be even. Working like a witch, you are a witch, unconscious witch, witch. You do you do many bad things, not that you you are willing, but because of because of what? Because of the agreement that you had with the kingdom of Satan. Now, brother and sister, right now, what we are going to do is to to to, to destroy. The what we are going to destroy, what we are going to destroy, the uh, the altar of the kingdom of Satan in our lives. Father, we are in your presence. We are praying that you may forgive our sins. Yes, any sin that is responsible of our problems, any sin that is responsible of our family, our family poverty, any sin that has plunged us into backwardness, any sin that has made us, for God, uh, uh, enduring uh, failures and failures one after another. God, we are here. We recognize that our families are responsible. Lord, forgive now the sin of idolatry. Today, Lord, we bow down before you and we pray that you may forgive us, O oh God. We pray that, Lord, you forgive our sin of idolatry. God, we have been and we, we have been our worshiping and serving other gods rather than you. Father, forgive us in the name of Jesus Christ. Wash us with the blood 
blood of Jesus. Today, God, I decree, uh, I, I decide to come out of the, uh, the, the kingdom of Satan and I come into your kingdom of Father. Today, I denounce and I renounce the false gods in our families in the name of Jesus Christ. And today, any agreement between the idols and our families, those oh God, our oh agreements, I render them none and void in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. God, today I am here to say ah, Jesus is my Lord. Jesus is my Savior. Therefore he redeemed me from the curses of the law when he became a, a curse on my behalf. As it is written, is cursed whoever is hung on a tree. Jesus Jesus has made me a child of God. So for that, right now I, 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 I decree and I declare, I am no longer a servant of Satan. I am no longer a servant of any idol. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, today I command the demons and the kingdom to release everything that they had been able to take from me in the name of Jesus. And today, let them know that starting today, I am no longer the adept. I am no longer the follower. I am no longer for the first to follow or, or to do anything. I am not bound by any of the, the laws and any of the agreement that they had with the, the house of my father and the house of my, my mother. In the name of Jesus, ah, fire from heaven, come down and consume and destroy completely any, any, any altar, any evil altar in the family of my mother, in the family of my father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. All the words that were uh, um, uttered and uh, pronounced in, in any evil alt altar, or oh, where, whether I was there or not me, but my family was represented there. In the name of Jesus, I decree and I declare that those words are now useless. In the name of Jesus Christ, I am no longer bound by any of the words that I uttered there. Even my mother, my father, or any member of my family has uttered in the evil, evil altars because maybe they went to the witches, they went to the um, uh, uh, bush doctors, uh, to the magi magicians. In the name of Jesus Christ, I am no longer bound by any of those words. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Father, I bless you, I honor you, I magnify you. In the name of Jesus, any sacrifice, any blood that has been um, uh, given into that uh, altar, be it by a cat, be it a, 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 a hen, a, a hen or a cock blood, a blood of any animal or a human blood that has been given in any of those altars. God, I denounce those uh, sacrifices and I renounce them in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Hey, any sacrifice, any blood that has been speaking evil things about you, let that blood be useless right now by the blood of Jesus Christ that speaks better things than the blood of those sacrifices. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, my brother, my sister, pour the blood of Jesus Christ in your life. Pour the blood of Jesus Christ in your business. Pour the blood of Jesus Christ in your spirit. Pour the blood of Jesus Christ in your soul. Pour the blood of Jesus Christ in your marriage. Pour the blood of Jesus Christ everywhere. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, let the blood of Jesus speak for you of better things that the blood, that oh God, any evil blood that is speaking against you, because all the blood that your family gave in any evil altar, that blood is speaking against you every day, because you sold yourself, it is there to say that it's by you 
that you gave your money, you gave away your money, you gave away your marriage, you gave away your education, you gave away your chi your fertility, your children, you gave away uh, your anointing, you gave away your Bible, you gave away uh, your life, the, uh, the, the life, oh, in the name of Jesus Christ, that blood, I command it to silence in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, uh, uh, you are from a family whereby the family itself is in, co in uh, contact with the kingdom of Satan. We have just, we have just come with the power and authority to, 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 to set you free. You are a prisoner there. You are a slave there. You are killing people. You do not know even that you may be a, a witch. That's why you are wicked. That's why you are doing many bad things, not knowing where they come from, because you are part of uh, of evil kingdom of Satan. And you entered there when your family, one of the members of your family or your representative went there and they signed an uh, 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 agreement, alliances. Whenever any of you went to ask from the kingdom of Satan, it's an agreement they gave you. It's a supply, a supply, and, 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 and an offer. No, it's a demand. It's a demand and a supply, a, 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 an offer. Meaning that you you had a, 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 a what uh, uh, you had a demand, and them they offered. So it was, there was an agreement between you both sides. They told you what, as they were offering you, they told you what you have, you are bound by. Among them, they gave you the spirits, the demons that work in you, against you, by the way. You don't know that you are the children of God. And now, and now the devil is happy to get you. They could not get you, my friend. They are doing anything possible to see how they can get the children of God. Now when they get you by yourself going there, immediately they, they do everything possible to maintain you in the kingdom. That's why that you will be in fact with even 2,000 2, demons in you, making sure you will no longer go back to, to God, making sure you will not go back to your, your, what, your, your identity, your status of being a child of God, a heir of the kingdom of God, a heir of God, and a prince, and a princess of God. Therefore, today, we are going in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, standing on our feet spiritually with our faith. We are going to command every evil spirit working in us to come out of us in the name of Jesus Christ. When they gave you anything, we are going to, oh, to, 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 to deny. We are going to denounce and to renounce everything that they gave us. If it's your, the money they gave you, maybe you went there looking for money. And when they gave you the money, it's just to kill you and to make you poor. If they gave you money, it's the money to, to destroy your business, to destroy your, your, your body, your health, to destroy your marriage, to destroy your church, to destroy uh, your relationship with the other people. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, now we are going to to, re, to 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 give back everything the demons had given you. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, we are here now. I command every evil spirits that have been working against me and against the members of my family, I command them right now to come out of me, to go to the waterless place, to go back where they came from. In the name of Jesus Christ, everything that you received from the kingdom, Satan, give it back in the name of Jesus. Satan and your kingdom, I give you back everything that 
came from your kingdom and into our family in the name of Jesus. If there is any evil money that we have been using from our children, our childhood up to them, that evil money, I give it back to you in the name of Jesus Christ. If there is any evil money from my my, my former my my forefathers or oh, up to me today, I didn't I disassociate myself from any evil money in the name of Jesus Christ. The money in our family that might have come from the kingdom Satan, I denounce it. I renounce it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. If the money that he had or God have had uh, uh, my father paid for my scholarship, if it has any evil evil contract, I denounce it. I renounce it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, give back to the devil whatever they might have given you, whatever they told you that they gave you, or give it back to the kingdom of Satan. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus Christ, even if it's a promotion, denounce it, renounce it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. If it's a fatality, uh, denounce it, renounce it, the fire in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Even if it's money, denounce that money. Yes, denounce it. Even if it's a car, denounce it in the name of Jesus Christ. No matter what you have received from the kingdom of Satan in evil ways, separate yourself from it in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, you might be having some books of magic, magic magicians. Yes, denounce them and renounce them. Give them back to the kingdom of Satan in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. My Father, my Lord, today here I am. I command the kingdom of Satan to take away everything that they had given us in my knowledge or unknowingly. Let them disappear. Yes, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, you might be there and every night or most of the day, the days, you dream about your uh, the forefathers who are already dead, the late, and you see, they come and they tell you, give us money. That's why today we are going to separate yourself from those evil spirits, then those evil spirits that come to take your money. Sometimes you dream of seeing someone with a, a basket telling you, give us money. We are going to separate ourselves from those evil, evil theft from the kingdom of Satan. Sometimes you dream, you see yourself, you are, you are dressed in rag, rag, rag clothes as you are a beggar. You are poor. That spirit you are going to, to, to consume by the fire or from heaven in the name of Jesus Christ. You have dreamed, you have dreamed seeing someone coming, stealing your handbag full of money or your briefcase with money. We are going to restore, uh, to restore our money. We are going to to, 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 to consume those evil spirits that have come to steal your money. Yes, you dream of, uh, of seeing someone sitting in your business. It's him or her that is selling your business, that is perceiving money putting in his or her pocket as your money must, your business must be protected in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You have dreamed anything telling you about your, your business, about your money, that it's as if it has been transferred from you and someone else is enjoying it. You have uh, an apartment, rentals, and you see other people. They are the ones that are perceiving the rent. My brother, my sister, let us now command those evil spirits to come out of your business, to come out of your life in the name of Jesus. Okay, fire, fire, fire. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, my Lord, my God, I send a fire on all the evil spirits that spiritually sent by anyone, sent by demons, sent by the kingdom of Satan. Oh, I command them right now to 
take the things and to go away from my business. Oh, you spirit of poverty, I bind you right now. I command you, come out of me in the name of Jesus. Come out of the members of my family in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Any agreement of poverty between the members of my family and the, and the kingdom of Satan, that agreement, those evils, evil covenants, they are right now known and void in the name of Jesus Christ. I render them powerless, useless. I am not bound by them in the name of Jesus Christ because the Bible tells me in 2 Corinthians chapter 8 verse 9 that ah, Jesus left his wealth in heaven. Uh, no, Jesus came to uh, came here on earth to become poor so that I and all those who will believe in him become rich. I am rich in the name of Jesus Christ. This is the sweat of the Holy Spirit by which I am destroying all the evil spirits that have been making doing everything to make me poor. Whether you like or not, the fire, the sweat of God is against you in the name of Jesus Christ. I am not poor. I am rich according to Jesus' ministry in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Any evil spirit, any error, errors of poverty that have been shot to me be catch fire and go in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. All the witches that have been doing everything to make me poor, I bind you right now. And all your powers, I render them powerless. Catch fire in the name of Jesus. Fall down, run away in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Yes, any point of contact is it, be it my picture, be it my money, be it my my voice, be it uh, uh, my clothes, anything that uh, that was mine and now is in the kingdom of Satan and they are using it to make me poor. Let it catch fire right now. I disassociate it from myself in the name of Jesus Christ. Even if they touch on it, I, I am dis disassociated. I am disconnected. <laughs> yes, from it in the name of Jesus. They will not have me. They will not see me in the name of Jesus Christ, any incantation from the kingdom of Satan to at at attack me or oh, financially, I render it powerless in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. All the dreams that I have had making me poor, those dreams, they are, they will not, not, uh, they will not, they will not come to pass in the name of Jesus. They will never come to pass in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Anytime that I've seen myself or oh, going back to the village, I, I, I say that dreams it will not come to pass in the name of Jesus Christ. Anytime you have seen yourself in a, in a, in a grass such the house of poor people, ah, let, let those uh, uh, grass such the house cut fire in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. You might have stolen uh, someone. And or you have, you might have done evil things against someone, and that that man or that woman. Maybe you have uh, you have uh, you have uh, you have uh, uh, stolen his money or her money. Maybe you have uh, been caught with his uh, with her husband, and uh, you have destroyed her, her marriage. Maybe you have uh, you have made someone being uh, sacked from a job, a well-paid job. Maybe you have uh, I don't know something, and that victim. The man or the woman who was victim, victimized by your evil deed gave him or uh, the power to go and to to cast you. Maybe he cast you, maybe he took you to the witches. Today we are going to ask for forgiveness of our sins because it's our sins that made him or her doing what he has done and which is actually making us poor. No matter what you are trying to do, so long as that person is accusing you because of your evil act, we ask for forgiveness and now we command every powers of darkness he has sent or she has sent against us to die 
in the name of Jesus. Because the power, the, the uh, Proverb 26 uh, uh, verse 1 says, so long as a, a, what, a bird uh, escaped, escaped, escaped uh, um, um, a trap, the way it's free, likewise, a curse without a cause is useless, is without effect. <laughs> Therefore, we are going to ask for forgiveness. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ, God, some people here, among, uh, uh, among them, me too, we might have got a, a stone from someone. We might have got killed someone. We might have got uh, committed, or oh God, sexual abuse or sexual immorality, or oh God, against him or her. God, we might have done something that led him or her, God, to revenge themselves. God, in the name of Jesus, forgive me, O God. Forgive us, O God. And the Lord, forgive us. And Lord, every, every consequences of our sin against them. God, I pray that you may heal it in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus, we forgive them, O God. Though they went to God, they went to God to do many bad things against us, we forgive them, O oh God. Lord, we forgive them in the name of Jesus and forgive them, them, and the Lord bless them in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh, my Lord, my God, we take power and authority, oh God, in virtue of the power of God that we received when we became children of God, and we command every evil spirit that they sent against us, every words, evil words that they pronounced against us that every curse that God they sent against us, we say let them die in the name of Jesus. We render them powerless. We render them useless in the name of Jesus Christ. You may know them. Mention them. Oh, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, those of God who have come, Lord, to steal us, oh God, who would pronounce them against us any curse, let those curse die in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I will not be poor. I will Will be rich in the name of Jesus. I will no longer suffer any, 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 any what? Any, I will no longer suffer any failure in the name of Jesus Christ. Everything of mine, I, I bring it back. I protect oh God my job. I protect my business by the blood of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. In the name of Jesus, signs and wonders will take place in my life. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, Father, we give you all the glory and the honor. Thank you. Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, we give you all the glory and honor. You might have a pro, you might have cast yourself by self imposed curses. In the book of, uh, of, of Numbers 14, we read it. How those people, by the word, they pronounced the curses against them and they died. I told you about that woman who was once a child and she confessed against herself that she would not have children if to give birth is so, so painful. You too, you might have pronounced such negative words saying that you cannot finish your education saying that you are just imitating people in your in their business just just in our family there are no one who is rich i was born in, in a, a, a poor family and in me too i am a poor we are aha uh -huh. you went even to the to to the witches i don't know what they gave you maybe they say they will give you children against your money, that you will not have money. Others, they may have, they might have signed, signed a contract like a priest, saying that we will live in a poverty like the priest. Others might have prayed such prayer, saying that God, I want to remain poor and to please you. I don't know, whatever has come out of your mouth, and that is against your wealth, against your prosperity, you are going to ask for forgiveness. 
before God. And after you have asked for forgiveness because you are committed, a, you have done an evil thing against yourself and against the God. And when you ask for forgiveness of that you have done and said, and now you will be able to change every evil words you said and you activate the positive one. In the name of Jesus Christ, God, we have uh, pronounced the evil, evil words against us. We have, uh, God, pronounced the poverty against us. We have, uh, God, accepted uh, into the kingdom of Satan negative words against us. We have uh, been uh, confessing that we will die poor, that we will live poor, even our children, even our marriages. But today, we are here in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Lord, we pray that you may forgive us. In fact, we are responsible of our sick, our, 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 our poverty. We are responsible of our backwardness. But today we are here to ask for forgiveness. Forgive us, God. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, every word, every evil word that is responsible of my backwardness, I right now, God, confess it. And I pray that you may forgive me, oh God. And starting today, in the name of Jesus Christ, I change that word. I activate right now all rich wealth in me. I activate prosperity in me. I activate all everything good in me, success in me. In the name of Jesus Christ, in whatever I endeavor, I will be, oh God, crowned with the, with the, the, with the success. I will be crowned with the, with the money. Everything today, I call myself Mr. Money. Oh God, my wife, Mrs. Money. God, my children, Lord, Mr. and Mr. and Mrs. Money. Everyone around me, we are money. Mr. Money, in the name of Jesus, Miss Money. Miss Money, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. All the evil spirits that have been eating my money, I bind them right now. Bind them, bind them, bind them. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Every, every water, every, every door of blessings that have been unlocked by the kingdom of Satan, I open it right now and I receive. In the name of Jesus Christ, money, prosperity, wealth. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh God, I give you all the glory and the honor. Uh, according to uh, 1 John, verse 1, Gaius, me to God, I am a, I am a God, prosperous in every area, as Gaius is, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. God, we give you all the glory and honor in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Today, as now we are coming to the end of our prayer, brother and sister, today I pray that really you may understand who you are right now. You might have, you might, you didn't know about it, but today we have now uh, destroyed the altar, evil altar that has caused us the spirit of poverty, backwardness, Failures. Today, we have learned about every evil thing, every evil ways. We know and we have said you might, when you get married to someone, yes, you come from, uh, from a family whereby poverty is striking, but uh, uh, your partner, no. But whenever they meet now, one and the other, they become one flesh. It means that they divide, meaning that even you who were supposed to enjoy your wealth, now you are becoming poor. Therefore, today, we are going to, to destroy all the evil spirits of poverty that are haunting you from your in-laws. In the name of Jesus Christ, let go and pray. In the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth, this is another wonderful moment. God, we are here. We are right now binding 
destroying all the evil spirits that have come from from anyone that I have I have had sexual intercourse in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Because of God, when you have with someone sex intercourse, the Bible says you become one person, one flesh. Therefore, God, every evil spirit of poverty that I received and that they received from me, let all the all those evil spirits come out of us in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ, all the evil, all the evil covenants, all the evil influences, all the poverty, all the failure, everything from the kingdom Satan, from my in laws, I destroy you in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth and myself, oh God. I declare, I declare that my pardon is also God, delivered from any evil spirit of poverty that I might have for God, 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 God in the name of Jesus. Jesus. All my children, they are no longer one because today I set them free in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Father, we give you all the glory now. We thank you, Father, in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. Oh God, we give you all the glory now. Tonight, this morning, we are here to say that now that we have a right to the kingdom of Satan, now, now that, that we have, we have set, set as a free, free. But, but we, we are, are now, now going, going to activate the spirit of all the life. The life of all the prosperity. Now, now it's, it's up to you. you. Now, now I don't, don't know, know who you are. are. Your, your dreams, dreams of becoming a great rich man, rich man, a tycoon, or oh, a billionaire, a dollar, a billionaire, a nation strong, a nation You are going right, 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 right now, right, right now, now, that, that the desire that, that you once had, 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 even if you, you, you have never had, had such a big vision, such a big vision, as you have been praying, you might have forgotten any great vision that you do, you were dreaming. To, to become, become a billionaire, a billionaire in, 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 in strong, 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 and strong, 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 didn't you, you were meant, meant to be rich, rich but, but so long that you are in your, your country, country because, because your country, country is, 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 is a I'm not, not telling, telling you to come, come out, out of that gun, no, no. But, but today, today it's, it's time, time to, to set, set fire, fire in that, in that country, country and, and, and to destroy all the spirits of poverty. Of poverty. And, and we, we are, are going, going to alleviate the poverty, not, not only to alleviate it, but also, also to eradicate it completely. In the, in the name of Jesus Christ, in the name of Jesus, don't laugh at your country. Bless it. Yes, set it free from poverty. Don't 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 go on on the 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 brain 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 no no we are we are going to talk the the brain 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 we are going to keep keep all all the people. In our, in our country, country so, so that we may make, we make our, our country rich. Let, let everyone in our country, country be what? Be, what? be, be rich. rich. <laughs> in, the, in the name of Jesus, Jesus we, have, we have this power, power and the end of the Father, in the name, name of Jesus, Jesus Christ, Christ, we start, start by this so God. God. I, I destroy, destroy every evil spirit in, in my country. country. And the, and the spirit of poverty, the spirit of poverty, the spirit of failure, the spirit of destruction, all the things that have been destroyed in the world. The one of my country, country everything, everything that, that has been, been making, making the people, people of my country poor, poor, poor everything, everything that, that has been, been making, making the people, people of my country, country fail in the everything, everything they have ever in the name, name of Jesus Christ, Christ in, in the virtue of power and authority, and authority in, in the name of Jesus Christ, 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 Christ,
in the prayer that does God's coming may be all God's prosperous in everywhere in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. I am standing in a member of the church that says free in the name of Jesus Christ of Nazareth. From any poverty, from any distraction, from any failure in the name of Jesus Christ. All the members of my family be set free from the spirit of poverty, from the spirit of distraction, from the spirit of Jesus Christ, I worship the blood of Jesus Christ. 
in the name of Jesus Christ. In the name of Jesus Christ. Oh, my brother, my sister, where you are, I know that you are not. And Lord, not yet in the night. I know that day you are not. But you are not. I know that day you are not a failure. A failure. But you are a successful man and woman. Today, I know that you are an old man. Oh, 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 everything now now belongs to you. Everywhere you go, it's your place. In the name of Jesus Christ, yes, yes, you are my church. Yes, 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 Brother and sister, sister now, now we, I, I bless you. you. Once, <laughs> once again, I bless, I bless you. Once, once again, again, I say, say may, may God bless, bless you. you. You have you been with the apostles of God and I shall remind you my YouTube channel is Apostles of this day and my WhatsApp number is plus plus two five five six. Seven, seven, eight, six, six, four, four, six, six five, five, seven, 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 one. May, may God, God bless you. you. I, know I know it was, was a, wonderful a wonderful moment. moment. And, and today, today be, be what, what you have made you, 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 you to be. be. And, and, and today, today live, live according to your, your prayer. prayer. Be, be according, according to what, what God, God has made you today. today. In, In Jesus', Jesus name. name. Amen. Amen. May God bless you.